Tonight in Health Check, a common quality of life altering side effect of breast cancer surgery can be severe swelling. It certainly can, usually in the arms and in the hands. But Health Check 10's Barbara Morse reports there's a local surgeon that's working on ways to prevent this condition. I have been the director of Women and Infants uh, Lymphedema Program for the past 11 years. Back then, there wasn't much they could do to prevent lymphedema, swelling due to the removal of the lymph nodes during breast cancer surgery. They could only manage the symptoms. By removing those lymph nodes, there is the potential to disrupt the normal fluid drainage out of that arm. That fluid then backs up within the arm and manifests as swelling. Times have changed, says Dr. David Edmondson, and one of his patients, Ellen Kurzer, is a beneficiary of recent improvements. The cancer was diagnosed as an invasive um, breast cancer of the left breast with positive lymph nodes. 19 lymph nodes had to be removed during her surgery in February of 2020, which put her at high risk of developing lymphedema. But Dr. Edmondson had been trained on a new corrective technique, which is done during surgery. We can save those lymphatics till the end, do what we need to do to remove the lymph nodes, and then reestablish a connection into the vascular system while we're there. I was glad they explained that procedure to me and um, it was very successful. Ellen, a mother of three, twin boys and a girl and grandmother of four is glad she has her quality of life even though there were some bumps in the road post-surgery. The radiation halfway through I started developing um, some pain in that arm and some edema. But they even have a way to prevent that from becoming a real problem using a device known as a bioimpedance to measure any swelling that is not noticeable. Studies clearly show that once it goes up six and a half points above the baseline, those are the early signs of lymphedema and that's the time to intervene. And again, we can bring lymphedema rates down to about the 2% range. As opposed to the 35 to 50% range interventions such as wearing a compression sleeve for a month and massage therapy for a month, Dr. Edmond says can prevent its progression. I'm very, very lucky and very grateful. For more on this story, go to turnit10.com. I'm Health Check 10 reporter Barbara Morse, NBC.